Hey guys, this is Dave with Mahalo Video Games, uh, back with another BlizzCon Invitational Round 1 match. Uh, this time we're going to have Huck, the Protoss from Canada, against Red Archon, the Terran from Thailand. That's a little bit of alliteration there, that was fun. Uh, <laughs> Huck famous, of course, for his, uh, or infamous in some cases, for his Mothership Rush, uh, a really fun player to watch and one that responds to the crowd. Uh, we're not actually at BlizzCon. Blizzard released these games afterward, but... Uh, so we don't know what the crowd is chanting, but Huck will sometimes uh, appease the crowd, <laughs> even in uh, very high-stakes matches. This one, for $25,000, of course, is what the winner gets of the BlizzCon Invitational. Uh, I would love to see a Mothership Rush here. It, I, I haven't seen it... Uh, the last time I saw it, it was not successful, so I would not count on it. Uh, but you know, you never know. Huck could uh, get crazy. Uh, <laughs> I read an interview recently where Idra was not pleased with the uh, the mothership rush. He said it was stupid and that uh, Huck had no chance of winning with it. So, a lot of serious players don't like Huck having fun, but we as fans do. And uh, he is going to go after this SCV with the probe and a little bit of combat, but running away. Red Archon now sending his SCV out to scout. Uh, ooh, Huck really wants this probe dead, so he can uh, delay that barracks from coming up. But it looks like probe's going to get chased off, and that's not going to happen. He's going to go get some minerals up there at that mineral patch. Yeah, he's going to come back with that mineral and bonk someone on the head with it, maybe. Oh, before I forget, uh, production. Uh, I did have a comment saying... Uh, that people would like to see production on. Uh-oh, that probe in a little bit of trouble. And uh, come to think of it, I do like seeing production on when I uh, watch a cast. So yeah, uh, we're going to keep production on until we uh, want to look at something else. So that probe got some uh, a little harass in there and got away with some scouting information. Red Archon now scouting Huck's base. Oh! That uh, SCV is in the red. One more shot from that probe. Oh, one more shot from that probe would have taken down Red Archon's uh, SCV. Interestingly enough, Red Archon, a Terran player. You would think someone with that kind of name would be Protoss, but... Oh, and Red Archon does lose a, an SCV. Red Archon at least got red, though, so half his name is correct. He spawned as the red player. And this probe taking this Zelnaga watchtower, doing a little probe dance, but the Marine's going to come in and chase him off. Uh, whoa, Huck going for a fast expansion. Wow. Uh, not sure if that's a good idea. Uh, especially with this reactor on this barracks pumping out double Marines. Uh, he could end up paying for this fast expansion. A stalker already out. Let's see what else he's got. Ooh, he needs to get chrono boosting some stalkers or... He's going to get in trouble at that expansion. Does Red Archon know about the expansion, though? Yes. Yes, looking at Red Archon's vision, he sees it warping in. He knows it's there. And uh, that could spell disaster for Huck if Red Archon decides to do something about that. Two stalkers on the field for Huck. It doesn't look like anything's going to happen, though. Uh, six Marines. Yeah. Oh, no, he, maybe he is moving out. We'll have to see here. I'm not sure if Red Archon has enough to take down this expansion. We've got a couple Stalkers and a Zealot. They're working on the rocks, though. And this probe's going to distract this Marine Force. This Marines want to chase down this probe, keep him from getting scouting information. Red Archon moving out with an expansion. Uh, so, yeah, it looks like both players are just going to expand. see what we've got. We've got more, another Stalker, and two more probes coming in for Huck. Red Archon now starting to make Marauders. Oh, and look at this. Two, those two Stalkers have come over here and they're taking out SCVs. A uh, little Stalker Micro will take out some of these Marines as well. Microing back and uh, that little stutter, stutter step and there's the Marauder coming in to chase, down, chase off these Stalkers. 
Stalkers don't want to give up, though. They are focusing down that Marauder. And, wow, now they, we've got five Stalkers out here for Huck. Huck pushing forward. That Marauder is down. These Marines are in serious trouble against this many Stalkers. Uh, that, if that Bunker doesn't finish in time, uh, he could lose this expansion. Uh, oh, I would love to see Huck snipe that SCV. Yes, the SCV building the bunker does go down. Now he's really got to push with these remaining units. But, oh, Huck with just beautiful micro pulling away his wounded stalkers. Oh, and the, there we go. The bunker's finished. Huck not giving up the harass, though. If that bunker doesn't have the range to get, in, get these stalkers here in the back of the mineral line, that's a lot of stalkers. This expansion is not going to hold against this. It's been forces. Oh, some marauders there. They're going to retreat to the bunker, though. And he is going to lose. Wow, he lost a... Uh, Lost a mule there, so that's no good. Huck's still attacking. Oh, it looks like concussive shells have finished. I did see that soccer slow down. That's not good if they get pulled into where that... Wow, that's a lot of marauders now. Uh, table's turning here on these stalkers. Unless he's got reinforcements coming. He doesn't. Uh, these stalkers are going to have to pull out, probably. Oh, but the marauder's backing up. Interesting. He's going to hide behind these hedges there. The marauders, of course, can't see past these hedges unless they've got someone on this side. And it's looking like he's going to come back around here by the gold. Loop back around and uh, maybe try for some more harass. He did a ton of damage to Red Archon's economy, though. So let's see what we're looking at here. Uh, yeah, Huck with 43. Wow, over 31 harvesters. So uh, minerals oddly even, uh, probably because of those mules coming in compensating. But uh, go back to production here. and All right. Stim finished researching. Stim plus concussive shells. And there's good force fields down, though. Good force fields. Gonna keep those SCVs from repairing that bunker. And the bunker will go down. Focus firing down those marauders now. Another bunker up. And here come those stalkers. If they can stay away from that bunker, they can do some harass on those uh, mules and SCVs mining there. They are... Oh, they have a clear shot up into that main base. And yes, they are gonna creep into this main base here and uh, do some damage to these units just spawning now out of the uh, barracks. All the SCVs coming out off the line to attack these stalkers and trying to get us around, trying to help out their Marines and Marauders stimming up now. Uh, SCVs chasing down these sentries, stalkers in the back doing damage to the economy and now picking out off SCVs, targeting down the SCVs, choosing to wipe out the economy, instead now finally attacking the, uh, the military units there, but wow, just Crazy damage being done to Red Archon's economy. Oh, wow. 52 probes for Huck. Only 35 SCVs for Red Archon. That is going to spell trouble. And, oh, Immortals on the way. Where? Wow. Oh, just look at all these units warping in. Units and structures warping in for Huck. This is going to be bad. Uh, ooh, pylons there in the back to protect any unwanted visitors and it looks like he's going to take out the rocks maybe not trying to finish off red archon just yet maybe taking this gold expansion here hey guys thanks for watching this is dave with mahalo video games once again if you guys have any requests for replays you want casted or questions or comments go ahead and send those over to requests at mahalo.com all right thanks again